A drought that has hit crops and economic growth in South Africa is also causing pain for specialist game ranchers who breed animals like antelopes and buffalo to cater for tourists and hunters. Peter Ernest Jr., whose family raises game 250 kilometers west of Johannesburg, says the cost of feeding his prized Cebu antelope have doubled the past year, but he can leave nothing to chance. This stage uh, we are buying up till January. Um, that we are, we know we have feed um, ready for the animals. So yeah, um, we hope for good rain in December, and then yeah, the feeding costs will drop a lot um, after six to eight weeks from we had good rain. According to industry data, game ranching is big business in South Africa, catering to the ecotourist and haunting sectors and investors who see price breeding animals as an asset. It has been growing 20% per year for the past 15 years. Our um, feeding cost went up with 65% and we are feeding now for 24 months non-stop and our numbers is still growing. Ranchers say record prize are still being fetched for iconic species such as buffalo, highlighting the resilience of the asset class as a luxury end.